Hi, I am Anna. I come from www.ntv4x.com. PMIS offer short-term relief analysis. Http ntv4x.com news ID 4BA287 8-3-2020-10-52-42 a.m. A mixed start to trading at the start of the week as attention shifts back to how economies are coping with the economic reopening. It's PMI week which means we get an onslaught of economic surveys from around the world, starting with the manufacturing sector today, and so far the releases have looked quite promising. Back in growth territory and surpassing expectations, just what we want to see as businesses try to contend with a new and uncertain future. Of course, these surveys can be volatile at the best of times and this is far from that. The risk of further restrictions and lockdowns will continue to be a huge cloud of uncertainty for many industries but after months of disruption, there may be a sense of relief at this data. Whether fears become a reality will depend on how good localized containment efforts turn out to be. HSBC slips on higher loan provisions. The impact of the pandemic has been extremely evident in bank earnings in recent weeks and HSBC this morning became the latest to make additional huge loan provisions. Weaker profits and provisions of between $8.13 billion cent shares down more than 5% and forced the bank to accelerate its turnaround plans. Oil remains in consolidation mode. Oil prices are down around 1% on Monday with WTI dropping below $40 after testing the level from above in recent days. The rebound we've seen in the dollar over the last couple of sessions is likely weighing on oil prices which have, broadly speaking, been peaking around the $40 mark for a couple of months. As long as we remain in the $38.42 range in WTI, there's no reason to think we're out of the consolidation period for crude. Gold takes another run at $2,000. The dollar bounce has certainly taken the edge off gold, although not before it took another run at $2,000 early in the session. This feels like a very natural place for gold to be experiencing some profit taking after hitting a new record high last week but there's nothing to suggest we're going to see a larger pull back at this stage. If the dollar continues to experience downside pressure, it may just be a matter of time before $2,000 comes under considerable pressure. Subscribe our channel to receive the news as soon as possible. Thank you for watching. If you want to read real time news, text messages to MT5 Expert Advisors page at https://mt5.expert.advisors.